Order of Endurance. In any city, in any country, go to any mental institution or halfway house you can get yourself into. Once inside, ask the person working at the front desk to see the Holder of Endurance. The worker should then take you down a hallway that couldn't be where it is. Eventually, you will come across a blood-stained door with inhuman screams of agony coming from behind it. The worker will open it for you and walk away. Inside the door will be hundreds of tables with creatures you can barely recognize as humans being put through unimaginable horrors. I suggest you do not dwell on them for too long. They have earned their fate. There will be one empty table standing directly in front of you, with a man in a black shroud standing over it. You must go in and lay on that table. The man will pull out a long chain and use it to bind you to the table. No matter how much you struggle, you will not be able to free yourself. He will then begin to torture you in ways no human mind could imagine, nor be written in any language of this earth. The worst thing is, while you are on this table, no matter what the shrouded figure does to you, you will not come any closer to death. You will be tortured here for what will seem like an eternity. The pain will be incomprehensible, second to nothing. Even the souls condemned to hell will weep for you. While this goes on, you must not let out any sign of pain, or else it will never end. If you can endure, then eventually the man will stop, unravel the chain that binds you, hand it to you, and render you unconscious with a blow to the head. When you awake, you will be outside the mental institution or halfway house with a chain wrapped around your hand. That chain is object 257 of 538. When the two ends are touched to an object, the two objects cannot be pulled apart unless you remove them. You have endured a fate worse than hell itself, but will you endure when they come together?